Welcome to the shortwave radio channel and uh, just want to uh, talk about uh, rechargeable batteries once again for radio. A lot of questions and I get this question at least a couple of times per week. Uh, you know when people buy rechargeable batteries they always uh, wonder if you know which ones that I use, which ones are good. Uh, not all rechargeable batteries are created equal. But there's a um, there's a minimum uh, to understand is um, most of the time what I will say is make sure that you buy batteries that are from a known brand is often um, a good thing. The other thing is uh, eBay is probably the worst place to purchase rechargeable batteries because a lot of them come from china and a lot of them are kind of fake branded so you might for example see um you know Eneloops from sanio and in reality you're getting cheap chinese batteries rechargeable batteries that are branded as Eneloops, but they are not the real thing it's a very delicate thing to buy batteries rechargeable batteries on ebay so stay with um, local providers most of the time the ones I purchase, and I'm, that's what I'm showing here, is Amazon Basics and IMH uh, batteries. They come in different uh, formats, 2400 milliamp hour or 2000 milliamp hour. Uh, the difference is that at 2000 milliamp hour, which is still pretty good, you get a lot more for a lower price. If you buy them at 2400 milliamp hour, you will see that they are more expensive. Of course, that 400 milliamp more will give you more time of radio with the same charge. Honestly, I have both the 2400 milliamp hour and the 2000 milliamp hour. Both are really amazingly good, and you will easily do, you know, um, a day, a full day of radio, even with the 2000 milliamp hour and even more. The. Uh, main thing is to make sure that you buy the you know branded batteries and and make sure that you buy the uh, latest versions of these batteries the batteries that are um that keep their charge so that you know if you um need them in a month they're still going to be fully charged um older batteries didn't have that uh, capacity and what happened is after a month, month and a half, they would be, uh, you know, they would not have any charge anymore. So when you need them, it's kind of, uh, you know, uh, bad because you need to charge them. And when it's an urgency, you need them right now. It's rather sad. Uh, so like I said, Amazon Basics are the one I use. They are uh, pre-charged and they keep their charge a long time. I really like these. They're a little less ex they're like less expensive than a lot of regular brands so that's also one of the reasons i wanted to try them um, so you get decent performance for the price paid um, that said you know uh, any duracell double a rechargeables or uh, energizers will be perfect i know that a lot of you are using other types and other branded batteries uh, that you like so, you know, the important thing is to make sure that you get correct branded batteries. Uh, that's very important. As for charging, which is another question I get a lot is, yeah, but about charging, um, do you charge them in the radio? I never charge the batteries in the radio. And the reason why is it's way too long, especially when you start getting higher capacity batteries. It's like an eternity before the batteries are actually charged. I know for some it might be kind of useful because you don't need a separate charger. I personally have a five hour charger, which is faster than what most radios do. And it uh, lets me charge the batteries externally. I've got two of them, so I can charge up to eight batteries. And that means that I um, pretty much never run out of batteries. Um, I've purchased new ones from Amazon Basics. I have the other ones that I purchased two years ago that are still really good. So that gives you an idea. The ones that I purchased about two years ago have now, you know, several dozen cycles done and they're still going on strong and really good. So that's why I purchased Amazon Basics again. Um, remember in charging, avoid the one hour chargers. 
these will kill your batteries really fast. The faster you want them to charge, the warmer they will get, the warmer they will get, the less you will have um, a lot of charging cycles because it destroys the battery when it gets too hot. So you want to charge them, you know, like a five hour charger is reasonable because charge them, it charges in a decent amount of time. It doesn't get too warm and it keeps your battery running for a long time. So um, avoid, you know, fast chargers. They, they kill batteries and they're really no good. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.